dive into the ocean, discover amazing sea creatures. Hey kids, are you ready to dive into the deep blue sea and discover some amazing sea creatures? We're gonna get up close and personal with some of the most incredible animals on this planet. So, strap on your snorkel, grab your diving fins and get ready for an adventure you'll never forget. Good day everyone and welcome to the wonderful world of dolphins. Now these blokes are more than just pretty faces. They're some of the smartest creatures in the ocean. They're like the Einsteins of the sea. Dolphins are incredibly social animals, living in pods of up to a dozen individuals. And just like us, they love to talk. They use a whole range of clicks, whistles, and squeaks to communicate with each other. They're intelligent, they're playful, and they're a vital part of our ocean ecosystem. All right, let's talk sharks. Now, I know what you're thinking. Sharks, they're scary. But trust me on this one, these creatures are misunderstood. They're not the mindless eating machines some folks make them out to be. Sharks have been around for millions of years, even longer than the dinosaurs. They're the ultimate survivors and play a crucial role in keeping our oceans healthy. See, sharks are apex predators, which means they're at the top of the food chain. And that's a good thing. They keep populations of other fish in check, making sure the whole ecosystem stays in balance. Did you know there are over 500 different types of sharks? From the mighty great white to the tiny dwarf lantern shark, which is small enough to fit in your hand. So next time you hear someone say Jaws, remind them that sharks are amazing creatures that deserve our respect and protection. Hold on to your hats, folks, because we're about to enter the world of the octopus, the true Houdinis of the sea. These incredible creatures are masters of disguise, able to change their color and texture in the blink of an eye. One minute you're a smooth, sandy brown, and the next you're covered in bumps and ridges mimicking a rock or a piece of coral. That's what these clever cephalopods do every day, and if that's not impressive enough, Octopuses are also incredibly intelligent. They can solve puzzles, open jars, and even use tools. Scientists believe they're one of the smartest invertebrates on the planet. They're also escape artists extraordinaire. They can squeeze their bodies through the tiniest of spaces thanks to their boneless bodies. So there you have it, the octopus, a master of disguise, an escape artist, and one of the most intelligent creatures in the ocean. Chapter 4. Sea Turtles, Ancient Mariners of the Deep. Now let's travel back in time and meet some true living dinosaurs, sea turtles. These gentle giants have been swimming the oceans for over 100 million years since the time when dinosaurs roamed the earth. Sea turtles are perfectly adapted for life in the water. Their streamlined bodies and powerful flippers allow them to glide through the water with grace and speed. One of the most incredible things about sea turtles is their epic migration. They travel thousands of miles across the ocean guided by the Earth's magnetic field to return to the very same beach where they were born to lay their eggs. Sadly, sea turtles face many threats, including habitat destruction, pollution, and getting caught in fishing gear. So, let's give a big cheer for sea turtles, the ancient mariners of the deep, May they continue to grace our oceans for another 100 million years. Chapter 5. Jellyfish, the pulsating beauties of the open ocean. Get ready to be mesmerized because we're diving into the world of jellyfish, the pulsating beauties of the open ocean. These creatures are like living lava lamps, drifting and pulsing with the currents. Now don't let their graceful movements fool you. Jellyfish are ancient creatures, even older than dinosaurs. They've been around for over 500 million years. Jellyfish come in a dazzling array of shapes, sizes, and colors. Some are as small as your fingernail while others can grow to be larger than a human. One of the most fascinating things about jellyfish is their stinging tentacles. These tentacles are armed with tiny harpoon-like structures called nematocysts, which they use to stun prey and defend themselves. So next time you're at the beach, keep an eye out for these mesmerizing creatures. Chapter 6. Clownfish. The little fish with a big personality. Get ready to meet the clowns of the coral reef, the clownfish. These little fish with big personalities are sure to make you smile. 
Now, clownfish and anemones share a very special bond. It's what we call a symbiotic relationship, where both parties benefit. You see, the anemone's stinging tentacles provide protection for the clownfish from predators. And in return, the clownfish helps keep the anemone clean and free of parasites. Did you know that all clownfish are born male? The largest and most aggressive clownfish in a group will actually transform into a female. So next time you see a clownfish, remember that there's more to these little guys than meets the eye. Chapter 7 Seahorses, the Dads of the Deep Hold on tight because we're about to meet one of the most unique fish in the sea, the seahorse. These guys are full of surprises, from their horse-like heads to their curly tails. Now, seahorses aren't the strongest swimmers so they rely on camouflage and their prehensile tails to help them survive. They use their tails like an extra hand, gripping onto seaweed and coral to avoid being swept away by the current. When it's time to mate, the female seahorse deposits her eggs into a special pouch on the male's belly. The male then fertilizes the eggs and cares for them until they hatch. So next time you see a seahorse, remember that these delicate creatures are more than just pretty faces. Chapter 8. Starfish, the resilient stars of the seafloor. Get ready to meet the stars of the seafloor, starfish. These colorful creatures come in all shapes and sizes, from the classic five-armed variety to species with dozens of arms. Now starfish might look like simple creatures, but they're full of surprises. For starters, they don't have brains or blood. Instead of blood, they have a water vascular system that helps them move and eat. And speaking of eating, starfish have a pretty unique way of dining, but here's the most amazing thing about starfish, their incredible ability to regenerate. If a starfish loses an arm, it can grow a new one. Chapter 9. Whales, the gentle giants of the ocean. Get ready to be awestruck because we're about to meet the largest animals on Earth, whales. These gentle giants rule the ocean, captivating us with their size, their songs, and their grace. Whales are mammals, just like you and me, which means they breathe air, give birth to live young, and nurse their babies with milk. But unlike us landlubbers, they've adapted to life in the water, developing streamlined bodies, powerful tails, and blowholes on top of their heads for breathing. Now, there are two main types of whales, toothed whales and baleen whales. Toothed whales, like dolphins and orcas, have teeth that they use to catch fish and squid. Baleen whales, on the other hand, have special plates in their mouths called baleen that act like giant sieves. So let's all do our part to protect whales and their ocean home. Chapter 10. Crabs, the armored knights of the seashore. Get ready to scuttle sideways because we're diving into the world of crabs, the armored knights of the seashore. These crustaceans are a familiar sight on beaches around the world. Crabs come in a bewildering array of shapes, sizes, and colors. From the tiny hermit crab, which makes its home in discarded shells, to the giant Japanese spider crab, which can grow to be over 12 feet across. Now crabs are famous for their hard exoskeletons which provide protection from predators, but here's the thing about exoskeletons, they don't grow. So as a crab gets bigger, it has to shed its old exoskeleton and grow a new one. Crabs are also known for their sideways walking. So, next time you see a crab scuttling sideways across the sand, take a moment to appreciate these fascinating creatures. Thanks for joining me on this underwater adventure everyone. We've explored the deep blue, met some amazing creatures, and learned about the incredible diversity of life in our oceans. Keep exploring, keep asking questions, and never lose your sense of wonder. See you next time.